Look who's in the background. It's hey, Br folks. It's Brad from Green Mountain Metal Detecting. <laughs> we, uh, we try to get together every year and do a little gold panning event. So here we are. We are on Broad Brook in Plymouth today. And we're going to see what we can get for some gold. So stay tuned. And Brad does like garnets, and I know there's a crap ton of garnets here, so. I got one! <laughs> there you go. <laughs> so here we go, and uh, thanks for joining us. I appreciate it, and we'll be back with you on the first pan. Okay, my first pan of the day. Six or, I got six. I can see six right there, so not big, but we're on the board with six little pieces. And, uh... We'll look over Brad's shoulder here in just a second. I'm sure he'll, he'll have something to show us, I'm sure. Yeah, we're up to seven or nine pieces. This is actually my fourth pan. Uh, I wasn't doing so well there, but I made a little bit of a move. Got some rock, more rocks out of the way, and I think we've uh, found a little bit of the gold again. So I'm going to have Brad move over next because I think he's finding very lower much lower quantities like that so one or two pieces per pan well let's see if this continues that is a good pan i stepped up stream a little bit trying to get get us on better gold so i think we're going to move upstream yeah so it's a nail oh brad just found a nail he's got his dais two out And uh, at least it wasn't a hot rock. Okay, like an idiot, I didn't record the last pan because I was so excited. But it was much like this one. That's three shovel scoops. Just three. Not even classified. And uh, the last pan before had some bigger pieces in it. So I don't know how many pieces are in that. But that's a good pan. I'm super happy with that. There is another good pan right there. Super happy about that. Man, if they keep going like this, we'll have some gold today. There you go. You can hear it. You can hear it when I drop it. Tick, tick. Brad's got himself a little picker. Yeah, that's nice. Beautiful. Aw, oh, heck yeah. Another decent pan. That's from down deeper. I just, I'm sort of amazed that there's not bigger stuff down there, but we're going to keep digging, so who knows? Might be something waiting, something special waiting for us down there. More gold speckled goodness. I think we're doing okay today. We'll keep going. Another good pan. Man, this is turning out to be a pretty decent day here. Nothing big. Well, that piece isn't too bad. Just decent, consistent gold. What more could you ask for? Damn, man. I... This is great. I'm going to have to invite Brad again. I think he's good luck. So, he's coming back. Just saying you're good luck. You're coming back again this weekend. <laughs> <laughs> All right, got to get over here because Brad's got a good pay. Oh, look at that. That was three shovels. The top three, four inches, just of the stream bed. Just right off the top? Yep. Perfect. Didn't dig down at all, which was great because I have a hard time doing that. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, couldn't be more happy. He ain't quite got the fat belly like I do. That allows me to put some more weight on the shovel. Look at that. Another three shovelfuls. Good golly, that's that's impressive. I'm loving life today, man. This is fantastic. Another decent showing. Still going here. Thinking it's uh, getting down to 
the last few pins left. I don't know. I haven't talked to Brad at what time he wants to leave, but we're in it to win it for a couple more anyway. Man, we are firing on all cylinders today. Man, those are some nice looking pans. Loving life. Such a nice day too. And Brad's still here. He's been having pretty decent day too. Uh, his pans are looking pretty darn close to mine. I, I've been able to sneak a peek here, here and there, see what he's got going on. But yeah, we're having a good day. I think this is one of Brad's best days ever gold panning with me. So I love it. Glad I put him on some gold. But here we go. Are you sick of seeing gold yet? I'm not. Not like that anyway. We'll keep going as long as it's the gold's coming. I'm gonna go until my back gives out. Oh, that's not my best pan so far, but we'll take it. it wasn't a blank. I, I'm on top of a rock and I can't get around it, so I just just took the material off from it. So hopefully this time I can loosen that rock up. We'll see. That would be nice to see what's under that. Well, it's getting on that time. I think uh, one more pan. And I mean it this time. So, just one more. <laughs> know what that was. There it is, last pan. Let's get this home and weigh it up, see what we have. It's going to be a good day, I can tell. Let's sneak around and see what Brad's doing, because this is his last pan. See, it's not everybody. Someone can film Brad filming. <laughs> I'll give him this footage for his behind the scenes video they don't make someday. Scott would take this home and do it slow and right. Yeah, I'd just fan it back and wow, that would pick out the big stuff and dump the rest off in my little container and do it at home. But I don't have the fancy water table or whatever it is. Miller Gold that Table. Oh. Yeah, the last batch I did, I did by hand in a concrete mixing tub oh. with a pan. You just did it by hand in a pan? Yep. Well, I have no illusions that I'm going to do that at home, so it would sit in a bucket. I'm going to do it right now, nice and slow. I did pull the black sand out first with my dry magnetic separator Whoa. by Mining Magnets. MiningMagnets.com. Shameless plug for Coulter Young. Oh, look at that. Yeah, he's going to have some gold in there. The only... The only thing with that mining magnets machine is you got to dry your sand out, which doesn't bother me. I don't process everything right off anyway. Oh, got some in there. Yeah. The last pan. Wonderful. Yeah. I'd say that was pretty good. It looks very impressive in the vial. Right? 
Looks very impressive. We're going to see Brad's day. Not as much as you had, but. But. Pretty nice yeah, there's some nice in stuff there. in there. Look at that. I'll take it. For sure. Now, if we weighed that, probably not a gram. No, probably not. But, what better way to spend an afternoon that's 90 degrees than finding real treasure for free in a mountain stream? We didn't shed any tears or any blood, but it was certainly a lot of sweat. All right, that's the whole day right there. I decided to dump it out. Brad wanted to get a get a look at it. Horsefly just these horseflies are big and they're bad. Anyway. Not a bad day. I can't wait to get this home, dry it out, and weigh it up. That's going to be a good day.